Hello Blocky Builders and welcome to a brand new world in a brand new series. We are playing Better Minecraft and I hope you enjoy this series as much as I enjoy making it. So in this series we will be doing a lot of exploring, building, but we will be doing it with a difference. As part of the rules for the series, I'm not going to be making any crafting tables, breaking any crafting tables, or destroying any structures, unless we mark them for destruction, which will mean we will have to destroy them completely and remove them from this world. So, without too much further ado, let's get going. The sun is rising and we need to find a safe space to sleep. The day doesn't last forever and we need to get going. Now since the aim of the game is to not make any crafting tables unless we need them to craft other items, we will need to be quick and find some naturally generated crafting tables. Now in this mod pack, Bet Minecraft, there is a lot of structures and I know a lot of them do generate with crafting tables in there. Ah, polar bear. The area around us is so beautiful and you will see a lot of beautiful biomes that's added in this mod pack. Now, if we look here in the distance, Looks like there might be something right over there and we would be so lucky if that is a peaceful village. But now I don't want to get too excited too quickly because I have played this mod pack before. Huh, more polar bears, bears. I have played this mod pack before and I keep getting distracted by what's around us. But anyway, as I was saying, I have played this mod pack before and I know that everything doesn't always seem as it looks at first glance. It looks like we've got a nice castle over here, but I am scared of being too comfortable. This could just be dangerous as well. Let's get closer and see. Maybe we are lucky and we can get started very quickly but ah uh, no 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 that's not going to be safe those are are they pillagers let's have a closer look yes this is definitely not safe and i think we are going to have to turn around and i tail it out of here maybe look in the opposite direction to see if we can find any safe structures. Just to remind you, we are looking for a structure with a crafting table so that we can get started. I'm not going to be collecting anything along the way because with all the blocks and items in this mod pack, your inventory does get very flooded very quickly. And before we pick up any loot, we need to save space to keep our loot. Now let's run around, see if we go in this direction, if we can find anything safe. So while we are running around, let's have a quick look here. There is quite a few advancements in this mod pack, which we'll, we'll return to later and inspect in detail as we try and get some of these advancements. So now we are finding some bunnies, it looks like. Now these rabbits are, when you're looking for them, you cannot find any. And especially these white ones in the snowy biomes, they are really hard to see if they are not moving around. If we can just get up this hill and see if we can spot anything. Oh, there looks like a nice cozy little house. That looks a little bit um, worn down, but I guess we can go closer and have a look-see. 
So by the looks of it, there's nothing, nobody living in this house, but we can never be too careful. So I just want to look around, make sure nothing dangerous is here on our tails. And then let's get closer and go and have a look. This looks really pretty out here. And then I see there's another building that we can go and have a look at. I hope either one of them does have a crafting table so that we can just settle down. But let's see. This one I see spider webs. So this looks really deserted. Let's have a look if there's anything inside. Overgrown. No door. I don't know whether it could be trapped or anything. But let's have a look. Nothing. Absolutely nothing in here. This. I think we could come back to this at a later point and just fix it up. I mean the whole aim of the game is to enhance the world that we are in. Let's go and have a look at this building. That looks like a nice quaint little house. And I don't see anybody moving around. So let's just go and have a look what's in there. Ow! Ow! What? What was that? those things we have to remember to be careful they do pack a punch and cause you to lose a little bit of health if you're not careful that could be really disastrous nice little house with flower pots in front of the windows and see where's the entrance here I can see some bookshelves Double doors for the entrance. The clock on the wall. That looks really interesting. Bookshelves. Lanterns. No crafting table. There are two barrels here. I'm not going to open them right now. We'll come back later to loot it. And then I also see these pots. Which I know sometimes could contain loot. But it looks like the journey continues. So night has caught up with us. But here between the trees I do see a little structure. And this looks... I, well, this really has to be safe. If this isn't safe we might be in for a tough night and not survive the night. Well, advancement mate. Welcome to Dungeons and Travel. Taverns. Safe haven. So this is safe we trust the advancements don't see anything dangerous at first glance there's somebody sleeping in that bed this bed's open so let's have a nap so our safe haven is safe in fact and i think this is a good spot to start the journey now guys i am bummed i am having trouble with the replay mod on this mod pack so I need to log in with a different account on another computer to do these cinematics. But we will make it work. Maybe I get the replay mod sorted sometime soon. Then I don't need to do that. But for now I think it, it will work. So over there I can see a crafting table and a smoker. There's a wheat seed. Our first item collected in this world is a wheat seed. Let's just have a look in here. Nice little bedroom. I guess this is the master bedroom. It's bigger than the one I slept in last night. And in the smoker, there's two pieces of charcoal, which I think can stay just there. Then we've got the crafting table over there, so we can actually start crafting items. This over here, we've got a little storage room with a chest. We'll come back for the loot in a 
few minutes. Let's just see. So what's upstairs? It looks like another storage area up here. Wheat bales and pumpkins. More wheat and another chest. So I have seen this structure before. So I know that chest on the top floor should have a map to a dungeon or another structure. Hello, Eugene. What have you got for me? A butcher trading meat. I'm sure we'll find meat to trade with you some way. Now let's just have a quick gander out here. Don't know what we should call this. Is it a shed or just an outbuilding? But there's some hay bales. Another little lean-to with more hay bales. We've got a well. Another shack outbuilding some logs so this is a really nicely set up safe haven it's got a wagon with a fletching table inside so that means hello frederick i guess you're a fletcher let's see what what trades do you have oh easy emeralds for sticks that could be of a great help so flint that's not really useful we've got a campfire to cook our food with so let's quickly have a look at the quest book that's in this pack i'll quickly run through it do the tutorial and then show you a quick glance at the quests that is available Again, the same as with the advancements, we will get back to it and dive deeper into it at a later point. For now, I just want to show this to you and so that we can get a start with maybe some storage for loot and then go back to the structures that we've already found, collect the loot, come back and make a start with what we are planning for this series. While I go out in the world and collect our loot from the structures that we have discovered, why don't you drop down in the comments and let me know. Have you ever played Better Minecraft? Are you considering it? And while you're down there, remember to leave a like if you've liked this video so far and subscribe to the channel if you would like to stay up to date with new content. And enjoy the time lapse.
Wow, so that was exhilarating. Would you like to know what we got? Let me show you. Let me show you all the loot that we managed to gather. How about it? I'm excited. Maybe we can start working on other projects soon. Wow, how's that? Isn't that too quick for you? Okay, now we found quite a bit of food. I think we are set for a while. Also got a few emeralds and some tools. Thank you for joining me. If you made it this far into the video, you surely have liked it. So please remember to leave a like. And if you would like to stay up to date with new content, hit that subscribe button. I won't disappoint you. Now, while I deal with this butterfly, I will bid you farewell. And I'll see you in the next episode. Remember to come back. We've got loads more to do. May your pickaxes forever be sharp. And I will see you soon.